Welcome people to today's video. Today we're doing a top 10 type of YouTube channels that are out here on YouTube. Hopefully this helps you choose a type of channel that you want to start up if you are barely getting into YouTube. This is all being shot on 4K so make sure to go ahead and change that monitor to 4K baby, so you can see this on Ultra D. So hopefully this helps out and you guys get to choose what you guys want to be on YouTube with this or you guys could choose not to be on YouTube hopefully this helps hit that like button if it does help it really helps this channel out to grow and leave down in the comment section what are the top five top 10 videos that i should do i'm thinking about doing a 3 a.m challenge people of the people around the ah! people that are living right here in the medford oregon area let me know in the dms on instagram where i should go to do a 3 a.m challenge because i want to do a 3 a.m challenge why does it seem so goddamn bright I don't even know what looks better. I don't really use the 4K, guys. I really don't. So anyways, let's get into this one. Let's not keep you waiting. Not long intros. Let's go. The number one thing you guys could be is a vlogger. I mean, most people want to start as vlogging most of the time. So why not just become a vlogger? But at the same time, if you have nothing interesting, your videos are going to be boring and just way played out and just way too long. Remember, guys, keys is cuts down to the bare minimum of the quickest way you guys can get your information out there. Remember that. That is highly important. Just plan out your days a little bit smarter when you before you wake up, guys. Make sure to be like, okay, what are we gonna do today or tomorrow? What are we actually gonna do to get something cool on film? Most of the time, you keep rolling like more than an hour's worth sometimes of film just to get a quick 30-minute uh, film. But you make sure that 30 minutes is completely interesting. If not, it blows. Most people's freaking vlogs, I can't stand them. I barely got into vlogging, but you know, I show around time lapse from here and there and the few funny moments, but most of the time I'm not just walking around. I'm, I just go and chill somewhere and shit happens there. If you, you know, if you haven't seen this one, go ahead and check it out. I'll leave a link down in the description, which is pretty funny. Anyways, guys, make sure you have your shit straight and make sure you have something to do because if you don't, your vlog most likely is gonna be boring. Yes, you have 24 hours in a day. No, you don't have to make it 30 minutes. You can make it seven to eight, nine, 10 minutes and just take your camera around where you think it's going to be a great time but if you don't have nothing to do all day it's not going to be interesting you're sitting on the goddamn couch or on the goddamn bed laying down playing video games or some shit at that point you're a gaming channel not a vlogging channel and you've got to switch up let's go on to the next one and the next one is actually what we're doing right now one of the you know top fives top tens top creepiest you know these are some of the channels i watch right here make sure to go ahead and let them know that i watch them too and leap down the sancho live crew is there Maybe we'll get a shout out and maybe we'll grow a little bit more. Because honestly, guys, people be telling me that I deserve more subscribers. So help, help me. Help me. Help me. Nigga. Make sure to help out your boy to get out there. So yeah, you guys could be doing that. But make sure you guys get your facts straight every single time. Do not freaking just go out there and think you guys can read one little thing and then just be like, oh, I know boom, 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 boom. boom. Bullshit facts speaking out your butthole. Make sure you know what you're talking about. I would tell you, okay, the 10 top freaking creepiest creatures that are down in the sea. Just make sure that yours is different from all the fucking other ones that are out there because there's like literally 30, 40, 80 of them and they're all the same, almost the same creatures. Okay, so just make sure you search shit up and find something good to be able to do a top 5, top 10, top 12, top 20, top 80, top 30, top 50. And by the way, that's another freaking subscriber that I really enjoy watching his videos right there. Subscriber. Another YouTuber that I enjoy right there. But at the same time, you guys know what's happening to his channel. What I feel is really sad. One of my most favorite YouTubers. I watched him from the start of Canada here to here to here type style. I hope you get back to a better place, man. I hope you get back up. Because 6 million subscribers and only getting 30 something thousand views is not right. Motherfuckers need to be more loyal, but that also goes with saying that this shit can get old, guys. They're just the same shit. Maybe it was that, maybe I don't know. Let's get on to the next one. Let's go. The challenge videos. Okay, you can just do challenges. It's exactly what the fuck it sounds like. <laughs> you do challenges, okay? It's, they're pretty fun. I'm not gonna lie, you have fun. If you guys haven't seen my other challenges, it's gonna be up here. Yeah, it should be up here. Make sure to check that out. Links down in the description as well. I collabed with a YouTuber. It's fun. It's great. Maybe we'll do some other stuff. Leave that in the comment section below. Video ideas or hit me on the DMs and let me know what other videos we should do. But if you guys are going to do challenge videos, make sure you kind of do videos that are a bit 
you know, uh... Make sure you go ahead and do a little twist spin off somewhere like that. I know I didn't do that on some videos because I just want to get content out and it kind of works. Try to become original if you can. I'm going to do a lot more of a better job to come out with content that has a lot more twist involved to it where it's completely mostly different. It's the YouTube game. <laughs> Okay, people, if you follow my Instagram, you know that I put up a contest about which drink that I was getting on my last video, and everybody got it wrong, and you know it already, but I'm still going to shout out your names. Go ahead. Say what's up to them. Show them some love. Thank you for participating. If you guys want to go ahead and be in that next time and get a shout out, go ahead and follow my Instagram right here. Thank you very much. Description's down below. Back to the video. And the other type of channel that there is is the shit-talking channel, the one that always talks about people every single time. They don't really get too many facts straight. Straight. They don't get too many facts completely straight and they just talk shit about people. Why they don't like them only because they see other people not like them or they just throw shade. I mean, I don't get it sometimes. So personally to me, I don't have enough gifts f to have to search other people up to be like, yeah, I'm gonna talk shit about this YouTuber because he's this, this, and that. I don't have the patience for that, okay? Shit, it's time to go to sleep, goddamn. I'm supposed to be tucked in. So yeah, I mean, if you're gonna be one of those channels that pretty much reviews other channels and see how good are the YouTube or you, God damn, I can't even speak. You know, if you're gonna be the channel, basically be like TMZ and just talk about other people's channels if they, you know, what type of YouTuber they are, if they're pieces of shit. You know, you see those ones around the internet all the time. Oh, why this YouTuber is such a piece of shit? Oh, why this YouTuber is, you know, bad for kids? Why this is really a manip, you know? And then you got Shane Dawson with the whole conspiracy theory. Maybe he's a conspiracy, you never know. If you're gonna be one of those channels like the other thing, you gotta do your research and not just bad talk people, okay? Never just stick to whatever somebody else says just because they say, just because they got whatever name. If I tell you something, look that shit up and make sure it's right to at least your perspective of what you think is right. There's always a right and a wrong. There's a wrong and a right and a right and a wrong. It's just from whose point of view you're seeing it from. But that's what it is. Okay. The fifth, that's not five, that's ten. The fifth type of YouTube channel that's out there is the short films. You guys can literally just make short films. Uh, that's kind of what I want to do too in this channel. Uh, let me know that in the comments, would that be dope? I'm just trying to do short films, not like vlogging or doing this type of stuff. Whoa! Not like vlogging or any of this type of stuff, like actual real life, kind of like movies, you know, short films, exactly what they sound like. You can go ahead and do those. I've seen a dope one right here. It's about Assassin's Creed. If I can find the clip, it's right here. Nah, I'm sorry. It was actually like four or five guys doing parkour. It was Assassin's Creed. They followed two of the American soldiers. They were wearing all blue. Okay. So back, they were chasing them. They were robbing some guy down the street. They chased him down. Got his ass. Yeah, America ain't as great as most people think. Stop trying to make it up. Motherfuckers robbed his Okay, the sixth thing is a podcast. If you like to talk about stuff, if you're an inspirational person, if you're a person that just has a lot to give with the voice, or you really want to talk about what's going on in the world, in the media, in the YouTube, and famous people, whatever, then you go ahead and start yourself a podcast and go ahead. Yeah, they last like two hours. It just get you a good mic, get you a good room, some insulation, maybe a friend or two that go ahead and come on the show from time to time. You definitely need somebody else there with you, not just by yourself, because you need somebody else to go ahead and kind of bump heads so you guys have something to talk about. If you want to do that, go ahead and get you a good mic, a good camera, and honestly, I don't know how many things podcasts actually need. I'm not going to lie. I've never, th I've thought about doing it, but I don't know. Another time. So the seventh thing you guys could do on YouTube is you guys could be a review channel. You guys could just review things, get packages and open them just like I do on my channel sometimes. But like I said, I just can't be wasting my money on just... You guys could be a review channel. If you guys have just things laying around the house, you can start off with that. That's how I started off. I just started off reviewing the same stuff that I already bought in off Wish. Yes, I've already used Wish before. You look at the old videos, they're nothing close to these videos, but I have gotten some dope stuff that really works from there. People just buy shit that is questionable like crazy. No, okay, be more logical, okay? China, gadgets, maybe, you know? Obviously not high price gadgets, just gadgets itself. Don't get stuff that looks very American and you want something that's really good quality. Don't go on Wish. And you guys can review anything. You guys can buy stuff on Amazon. It doesn't have to be Wish.com. It could be anything. You could review channels, YouTube channels. You could do all that type of stuff. 
You don't have to just do boxes, you know? Or you could be an unboxing channel. People love watching unboxing channels. I watch unboxing channels. Let's go on to number eight, and this one is quite an old one. You guys could be a prank channel. You guys can go ahead and get pranks, but just make sure you have some authentic shit, not just somebody that other people have done already and you've seen a lot on YouTube, okay? That's the same reason why I won't even do the liquid ass <laughs> videos because that shit has been done a lot. But yeah, you guys could be a prank channel. Just remember to think of something new and all that shit with hijacking people and killing people. Fake killing people is not the way to go. You already seen what happens when that happens and I never even heard of those YouTubers ever since that shit. Number nine, see this one's crazy. You guys could just be a kid's channel. That takes dedication. You guys could buy toys, review toys. That's one of the biggest things out here that I, you know, check out Ryan's toys, you know, blooper, bleep beep, whatever his name is. I don't know, it's weird. People like to see kids have fun. Kids like to see other kids have fun. But be very careful. There's a lot of terrible, terrible garbage out there about kids' channels. Stupid, major, garbage, pieces of shit type of people out there that make the most worst shit for kids. I swear I cannot stress this enough. There's some real f***ing weirdos, pieces of f***ing shit out there that make weird ass content. Superheroes doing inappropriate shit. It is really f***ed up how these people do this shit. If they expect adults to watch this shit, you're out of your f***ing mind if you think adults are watching some shit like that. Anyways, let's go on to the next one. Let's go on to 10. Now this one is pretty different and I don't think that I could really do this yet. You guys can break myths, okay? Yes, you guys can go ahead and just find stuff that people say you could do and then see if you could really do it. Either prove them wrong or prove them right. That sounds like really good fun, but when I wanna do it, I wanna do it big. I, in this channel, I eventually, I wanna have enough money to be able to give out a lot, you know, the people that need, and also be able to blow a lot of shit up improve a lot of shit so yeah you guys can break theories break myths if you find some diy that just seems way out of hand way out of line you guys can try that shit and see if it works or not for a video but please be careful with some of the things that are out there you can get hurt okay wear protection if you're little make sure you go ahead and have your parents because they will know the right things to have for you to be safe enough to do this without having to either lose a limb because shit can get dangerous, guys. Shit can really get dangerous. Last time I was chopping wood and I almost cut my whole fucking foot. Yeah. Here's my foot. There's the axe. And these are my toes. So, thank you very much, people, for watching this video. If this was helpful, if you decided to choose what channel. Hey, thank you very much for watching this, guys. Everybody have a good day. Leave down in the comment section below anything that you guys would want me to do on this channel. You know, go ahead and let me know. Thank you very much for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. I've been doing my thing, yeah. like every day I just like I'm shit. not okay, nah. bump that 808 Light up the light green that keep me afloat When we fuck, we rockin' the boat And I'm rockin' the live bass Or pussy the best, I put it to rest Smokin' that good and I